In Chaos Control Cloud, customers can be assigned to different company classes. This allows for more detailed sales analysis and reporting. It also sets the default attributes for customers and suppliers. To set up your company classes, you need to go to System Setup and System Data and then double click on the company classes line in the grid. Once the screen is open, you can go into edit mode and if required, you can create a new company class or you can edit existing company classes. First of all, we'll look at some of the default attributes that will be applied to customers when they belong to a specific company class. Although these attributes can be changed for individual customers in their company record you can give the company class a name or description. You can then define a blanket discount for customers that belong to a specific company class. For account customers, you can define the terms in days, the terms type, in our case we've used the invoice date, and their credit limit. You can also set a default payment type. You can also set up a default price list, which will be added to all new customers belonging to a particular company class if the price list required option to the right is ticked. The calculation method is the method of calculation to be used when selling to customers belonging to a particular company class. For example, net for B2B or gross unit B2C. You can set up a brand that will be used as the default for the company class. You can link a sales nominal to a particular company class, so all sales from customers belonging to that company class will be entered into that sales nominal. You can define a nominal classification to link to a particular company class. Manual prices if this is enabled, the system will ignore any promotional prices or discounts set against the customer or company class and allow the operator to manually key in any price when adding the stock item to the sales orders. If the search exclude option is enabled, any customers belonging to that particular company class will be hidden on a customer screen unless that company class is selected and the filter is on. Assigned stock option, assigned stock to sales orders. If it's not enabled, the stock will be postponed on that order. Price list indicates if the company class is a price list that has been added in the price list screen. And if the price list required option is enabled, then a customer with this company class can only purchase items contained on the price list. Including safe level provides an opportunity to exclude the sales orders for particular company classes from the calculation used to reassess stock levels, which is used on the reorder report.